You know, he's doing a little calculation there. We were just looking. There's a, uh, the New York Post today talks yes. about a guy who has on the Internet a death calculator. If you're interested in how long you're going to live. I'm, this, I'm, I don't want to know. This guy's uh, website is Demco, D-E-M-K-O. Dot com and right across the top it says the original death calculator life expectancy quiz calculating death rates since 1974. All right, and so we started doing some of them. They, they ask you a bunch of questions, and you can check it out on NewYorkPost.com if you want to go to it also. But uh, I guess you start with 79, which is today's average life expectancy. They let you uh, subtract and minus years based on things you do, like do you smoke? Uh, do you have grandparents that live to be over 85? Do you volunteer? Do you have a pet? Uh, adds two years to your life. Adds two years. So far, Brian, you're at 88, and I'm at 90. 95, but we only got halfway through. Uh, you'll miss me. Uh, <laughs> if you want to live long, be right-handed, be uh, physical fit, have a girl, um, and eat grain. Right. Here, let's... Uh, Two let's, daughters, if you really want to live. L that's right. Uh, let's go ahead and play along at home. Answer this. Are you a female? Plus one. If you're a male... Minus two, subtract two from 79. Do you volunteer on a weekly basis? If you say yes, add two. If you say no, subtract one. Do you live this, alone? This is minus a, three, excuse me. Here's a neat if one. You, if, oh, sorry. If you have two or more daughters, ahead. if you have two or more daughters, Listen. you're supposed to live longer because daughters usually are the ones that look after you, Steve, and you have two. I do. And so do you. And, and they're very nurturing uh, girls, so mm -hmm. you're probably in good hands. I think so. <laughs> So anyway, you know, then, see, then some of those girls that are stuck up. Your uh, girls give and they care. Right, they're they going to have a great. They're uh, volunteers. In fact, uh, one of the questions is, uh, do you volunteer it. once a week? If so, add two. If you don't, uh, you should. So then, at the end, what you do is you just add everything up. You start at 79 plus two minus one, and then you have uh, your estimated length of life span. How long is Paris Hilton going to be in the headlines? Well, she's going to be dead by 73, so get used to it. Uh, she's, she's only 79. Oprah, excuse me. <laughs> You're klutzy, minus three. Yeah. Um, Oprah Winfrey's going to live to be 89. How about that? Uh, good. I'm sure she'll still be in the air. Jessica Simpson will be 79 and, and uh, single. Yeah, because Nick, those two are perfect for each other. How is she ever going to get someone to replace Nick? <laughs> if, if you're married to somebody from a boy band, subtract six. Right, and which is a this, weird category. This one says for every inch your height exceeds 5'8 minus six months. Why is that? Uh, taller. The taller you are, the more right. stress and strain on your heart and infrastructure. Wow. Remember uh, Attila the Hun? Sure, very well. 5'8. Mm -hmm. And look how long he lived. Yeah. How long did he live? I'm not sure. I'm trying to <laughs> small talk. I know he went over to CNN. Yeah. According to uh, this, I'm going to live to be 102. You did you yours know, 102. But you're not, you can't possibly be truthful. 102. Which one you want to live long? No. no one which one did I not do? Okay. I don't walk to work. So minus three. You know what? A big one is the family history. So you have a lot of uh, mm -hmm. grandparents that lived a long time. Right. You don't have a history of heart disease in your family or cancer. No. Listen to See this. That? Cosmetic surgery. Minus five for each decade you have a procedure. That's right. So it's killing you to put plastic in you? Wait. For each yeah. I decade? See, I didn't add anything to that minus because I haven't been injected. Minus one for each additional procedure per decade. Poor Joan Rivers. I'm going to hug her like there's no tomorrow. But like, <laughs> I'm not going to let go. But like, here's, here's an example, though, this, that you could sort of, if you wanted to cheat this thing to live longer. Griffin. Do you own an interactive pet, like a dog or a cat? Could you just keep at, you get two points. Would, what if you just had a kennel full of dogs because you want to, like, you know, be up to 105? But then yeah. you've got, you mean real dogs or phony dogs? Real, real. Oh, Electronic this is, dogs. This is... No, an interactive pet. I mean, they I, mean I know, but I, what I'm saying is if you had a whole panel of them, <laughs> it's going to drive you nuts. Right. That'll be bad.